Once you've chosen your 16-bit local adaptation mode, the next step in the HDR process is to remove ghost artifacts from your photograph. Ghost artifacts occur when small or large objects in your frame will change position slightly from one exposure to the next. The more exposures you have, the more likely that something in the frame will move. And so the net effect is when you bring the exposures together, it has the appearance of the same objects being replicated right next to one another. So we wanna make sure that the scene is uh, presented accurately and removing ghosts is a big part of that. Looking here at 100% view, we can see the leaves and branches down uh, near the cave are pretty still, but up at the top of the frame, uh, you can see some pretty obvious blurring. And that's not because it's out of focus, that is because of a ghost artifact. So I'm gonna move over to the uh, remove ghosts option. I'm just going to click on this. And after a few seconds, it will process and you can see that the blur is almost completely gone. Now, the trick here is that we can select any one of our exposures as the base image for removing our ghosts. And this can also impact the exposure uh, details in some cases. So if I go ahead and click on uh, the neutral or zero EV exposure, you can see that we get further changes here. And you'll also notice that we've got some changes uh, along the rock wall in terms of preserving some of those highlight details that were not preserved in the original attempt. So it pays to click through some of the different options and see what type of changes you get between each one. So now that we've done this, uh, we've got sharp subject matter throughout and we've got some additional details preserved and we're ready to move on to the next step of the process. Now incidentally, if you decided, um, if you had five or six exposures and the brightest two or the darkest two exposures, for example, were very close to one another or didn't really add any additional detail, you can remove an exposure from the entire merge by clicking on the little green checkbox. And so um, that's something to keep in mind if you know, you've got a slower computer uh, and you want to uh, basically move things along, that's an option as well. So I need to go ahead now and uh, reset this remove ghosts because I removed an exposure uh, from the process. And uh, here again, we're ready to go to the next step.